bulk. So I decided it might be a good idea to save a little time and, oh, you gotta be kidding me. Uh, well, my battery's about to die, but we'll see how far we can go with this. Um, I figure it might be a good idea to try a couple of videos with me driving um, so I could kind of talk about a little bit of the definitions that we have to go through and so forth. So what I want to talk about is, you know, what is the reverse order of operations? And the reverse order of operations are, if you think of the order of operations, right, it was PEMDAS that I used, where parentheses and exponents come first, then we did multiplication and division, and then a distance and subtraction. So all the reverse order of operations are is just that backwards and there's probably some acronyms that we use um, that are used by other teachers to help you remember it but basically if you can just remember you always want to undo when solving an equation always want to undo addition and subtraction first then multiplication and division then we undo exponents and parentheses so it's the exact same as using the order of operations except it's just in the reverse order so that's all we're talking about when we're saying uh, use the reverse order of operations. So hope that makes a little sense for you. Just when I say reverse order of operations, remember that pretty much means the order of operations backwards. So hopefully that uh, helps you out and it makes a little more sense for you. All right, thanks.